Hello friends! Today we are in Morgan Hill. My sister found another little flower spot for me to take pictures uh, with. It's actually a dried up lake and since the lake has no water anymore, uh, all these flowers started blooming, these purple flowers, I don't know what they're called, but I will leave the address to the park in the description box and you guys hurry up and come check it out because when I last saw the pictures, this was taken in like April. I haven't stepped out of the car yet, so I don't know if the flowers are still in full bloom. You guys will see that with me. So let's go on out. There's only a tiny little stream, which is just so sad. But we're just gonna look around the area and try to find the perfect spot to take a photo. flowers which was kind of underwhelming still beautiful but we stayed for the dried lake bed it looked really cool the ground was cracking so there's a lot of these cool patterns and if you take kind of like a bird's eye view shot down it looks really cool um, I did take some pictures so make sure you go to Instagram and check them out we're gonna go get milky <laughs> oh, durian, look. <gasps> Ooh, wait, is that the smelly one? Yes. So we got an avocado smooth, avocado mango smoothie. This part is avocado mango puree on the bottom. And I also got a pudding. I was gonna get a drink here originally, but then I think they specialize in desserts which is a pudding. So I got mango mochi coconut. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh. Wow. Mango, mango bits, coconut. I think there's supposed to be mochi in here somewhere. Back with a spoon. <sighs> okay, I got a little bit of coconut pudding, some mango bits. There's a little piece of the mochi. Wow. Mmm. Wow. Ooh, the coconut is really creamy. Mmm. The mango is not too sweet. It's really good. There's like little pieces of sago in there. Everything just works so well. Oh my gosh, I can eat this really fast. Because it's not overly sugary sweet, it's just kind of like the natural sweetness of the of the fruits. This is really I think this is a pretty unique dessert. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna chill in the parking lot and um <laughs> even weird saying that okay we're just gonna eat this try the smoothie and we'll see you guys next time hello friends we're in san francisco and we are visiting the sutro baths area before we head ooh, to the land's end trail kind of going down a pretty steep hill right now but ooh, it is randall's first time here i haven't been here in probably like five years or so so it's still as amazing and beautiful as it was last time the weather is a little overcast but i think it still looks so beautiful i love the landscape of san francisco and everything it has to offer let's go take a look around
looks like we got to go back up to where we came from so we can begin the lands and trail up there. Oh my god, I had a breath. Coming up on a better view of the bridge. Still a little foggy, but beautiful. I underestimated oh my god it's not even centered I underestimated this hike I'm wearing jeans I thought we were just gonna like have a stroll anyways we are finishing up this trail and going back to the car we are going to eat now we're gonna go to hula hoops which you guys have seen in my vlog before but we love it so much and since we're in the city we're gonna go back and take my bro with us. Hoo. We are now actually at Murakami Udon because Hula Hoops is closed. <laughs> I didn't know they closed at three, so we're gonna get Udon. We haven't had Murakami in years. It's been years, but it's one of our favorites. We first had it in Hawaii. You get to watch them make the Udon noodles. What's that? Oh, oh look Tony, here's the menu. Here's the menu. Oh, you want like a sandwich, right? The yeah. chicken cut. You want to try one? Wow, this is new. Katsu sandwich. I always get curry. Oh, okay. Yeah. But maybe I'll get something more plain. I got a curry nikutama. Randall got a regular nikutama. I don't know what nikutama is, but Tony got a tonkatsu. Oh, and we also got some sides. Chicken katsu, potato croquette. He got a tamago tempura and shrimp. That looks good, the tamago. Mm -hmm. I want to try Let's dig in. <laughs> up a new milk tea spot wait we just went to a new milk tea spot called true den true dan i got a fresh milk with brown sugar randall got the same thing but with oat milk how do you like it did you fire. taste it fire it's fire yeah it's good Whoa. tony got chrysanthemum honey lemon chrysanthemum tea it has like <laughs> actual flowers in it and stuff <laughs> it's like a like a snow globe the boba is still warm. Mmm. Rich and creamy and sweet. I got regular sweet and she says that it's pretty sweet, but I like it really sweet, so. Hmm. So this is my drink, but with oatmeal. It's definitely different, but it's still pretty good. Mm -hmm. Very creamy. Mmm. Oat milk's the best milk alternative. We like it because it has a good texture, it has a good creaminess. That is the end of our little adventure for today. Thank you for coming along with us. Everyone say bye. Tony. Oh. Bye. We decided to have lunch at the Rose Garden, or dinner actually, my bad, it's dinner time. But, um, oh my gosh, the roses are in full bloom. Behind me, I just wanted to get a chance to soak it all in before it goes away. 
We are having frugetsu, which is Japanese food. We got a little... This is kimbap though, this is Korean. Tuna. This is a mix of different types of tempura. There's meats and vegetables. Karage, black pepper karage. And of course, an okonomiyaki. trying to find various spots to take pictures. I mean, everything's pretty, everything's pretty. So, a lot of choices. <laughs> the sun, whoa, it's like right on the horizon. I'm looking really red, but look at all these roses. What a dream. We are done in the garden. We have taken very beautiful photos. Oh, sorry, I'm cutting you off. Um, but this place is super beautiful. Hurry and visit before all the flowers disappear. They're in full bloom effect. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for watching the vlog and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.